Hello. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to upload content in bulk. So these are my libraries. Let's go to iCare and uh, there is add content. And here you'll see a button called upload in bulk. Click on that and it will bring a new screen to you. So here you could upload multiple image posts or your text posts. Let's go with image posts. Um, I downloaded a few so I'm gonna go to downloads and here are some images. So I'm gonna pick a few images, click open and then what it does is it's gonna create different posts for me. So it's still loading those images so it will take some time but So I guess that's about it. Um, now what I can do is I can add a caption here. I could say this caption will be applied to every image. And then I could say add caption. So this one is applied to every image. I could also say stop recycling after for any of these images. So once I have all the caption, um, I could say add to library. I'm not going to do that because it, otherwise it will add me to my existing library. <clears throat> Another thing you could do is, let me um, try that. Let me cancel this. And add content, upload in bulk. Now this time, because I want to show you something, I'm going to upload just two images. What you could do is, see there are two images and if I have two captions here, this is for first image and this is for second image. And if I add a caption, it'll ask me that you have two images and then you added two text here. So attach entire text to every image. I don't want that. Add one item to one image. So this is for the first image. This is for the second image. So that way I was able to add separate captions to separate images. So if you have a lot of things, you could do that. What if I had a link? Let's say I want to add this link or this link. That works. Same thing. So now let me just show you one more thing. How about text posts? Same thing. Breakerpost.com is, is an amazing tool. I like reading Mashable at http mashable.com and then you add it to the library. Once you do that, now see because there are links, it will try to pull data from those links. So it picked the image, the title, and it also picked the description for Mashable because I used the direct home page link. So it pulled the title and the description. If you push, put a link here, it will pull the data from that link. So this way, if you have a list of, let's say, 100 posts on your blog and you put a link to all of those it will pull all your images all your titles all your description and then you can simply go there and change something if you wanted to change I love it you see it's simple you can change anything you want You know, so it's really easy to um, change things around here. Finally, you add it to your library and it will go and sit in your library. Isn't that simple? So that's how you upload content in bulk. Thank you.